We turn now to some food for thought from author David Sedaris. I was in the breakfast room of a nice hotel in San Francisco, and as a maitre d' showed me to my table, I told him that I followed a strict Hegan diet. Vegan, he asked. No, I said, Hegan. I only eat things that were male. I'm hoping that's all clearly marked on your menu. His face fell. I'll need to know what sex my eggs are, for instance, if I decide to get eggs, I said. Sausage being such a hodgepodge is impossible for me, but I do enjoy bacon from time to time. It just has to come from a boar rather than a sow. I'm hoping you can verify that for me. At a diner, you'd be laughed out of the room, and for good reason. But in a fancy restaurant, it's let me uh, talk to the chef. I tried the same line at dinner that night, and again, I let it sit for a moment before admitting that it was a joke, something I just made up. Well, thank goodness, my waiter said. I mean, this is California. We get it all here. So I naturally assumed this was a new thing. What, I wonder, would be the point of hegenism, other than making yourself seem unique or righteous in some way, though that often seems reason enough. There are hardcore fruitarians who only eat things that fell to the ground naturally, thus sparing the apple or orange or fig tree any unnecessary trauma. Then there are freegans who don't believe in waste and only eat food that they find and don't have to pay for, including roadkill. I met a guy in a plane once whose daughter had just gotten sick from eating an overripe raccoon carcass. In the movie Trans America, one of the characters identified as a level four vegan, explaining that he only ate things that didn't cast a shadow. Is that real, I wondered? It wasn't, but I was fooled until I looked it up. When it comes to food, or face it, food in wealthy industrialized countries, nothing's too crazy now. That's why when I saw the words, eat the rich, spray painted on a building not far from my hotel in San Francisco, I thought, as had my waiter at dinner the previous evening, really? Is that a thing now? <laughs>